A story we've been following for weeks. Rome crews are preparing to start drilling on Lisbon Street in East Liverpool tomorrow. City Council approved $100,000 in emergency funding last week after the street started cracking. 27 First News reporter Derek Lewis was on the scene today. He has the latest. Since last week, Lisbon Street in East Liverpool has been falling apart. I can't believe it. I just, I, I don't. I, I never thought that something like this would happen. Neighbors say every day it continues to get worse. Brittany Amacone used to live on this street. She's back today to help Judy Blazer, an old neighbor. Blazer is currently at a hotel. She had to leave this house that she's lived in for 80 years after the city condemned it. I think that what she's going to, that she's, what she's most upset about is the memories. She's going to lose the memories. Crews from the water department are cutting off water lines to old homes in the area. They don't want to lose water when drilling starts Thursday morning. Service Safety Director Brian Allen says drilling will take about four days. After that, uh, we'll wait for the laboratory results. Once those come back, we'll actually put together a final plan to submit to the Ohio Public Works, the Ohio Department of Transportation, and the Federal Highway Commission uh, to help resurrect the situation. Allen, crews with the water department, and neighbors have all called this an inconvenience. Drilling will help figure out how this happened. The city already has an idea. It's natural causes is really what our engineers believe at this point, that it's just natural slippage of the slope. The traffic will be down to one lane while crews work on the problem. The city has condemned these three houses, forcing people to find somewhere else to live. In addition to packing up her friend's furniture, Brittany says she's also raising money to help Blazer who just lost her husband last October, get back on her feet. In East Liverpool, Derek Lewis, WKBN 27 First News.